Alright, okay, so let's have a rundown of your mucopolysaccharidosis. So, um, we have different MPS. They are numbered accordingly. And for now, what we're going to study is the most common and what is given to us. So, we have five to study here. We have your one, two, three, four and uh, seven the other one is seven 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 all right so for your number one and two we have your h h the first one is your hurler hurler and the other one is hunter actually both of them have the same clinical presentation but the difference is your corneal clouding so when you say hunter that means it needs a good vision so there is no corneal clouding hunter just remember that hunter hunter so we're going to put our clinical presentation here clinical presentation so we're going to put our clinical presentation here so for hurler we have your corneal clouding so like it's like saying the vision is hurly hurly blurry hurly clouding corneal clouding corneal clouding so with your hunter there is no corneal clouding by the way just for generalization what we have here are enzyme deficiency so usually when there is an enzyme deficiency it means or not really means but usually the transmission is your um, autosomal recessive or AR so most of them I are AR autosomal recessive but we have exception here that is with your hunter that's why I want to remember this as your hunter x hunter so that will also remind it that that will also remind us that it's MPS2, Hunter x Hunter. Now, I also want to remember this as Hunt 2 x Hunt 2, so that we're going to remember it as MPS2. So again, you have your X here, alright? So for the other clinical presentations, we have your mental retardation. So, yeah. So let's put some divider here so that we won't be confused. So here, again, we have corneal clouding for hurlers only and then this one for both. So we have your MR. Again, for, your general, for our generalization, all of the mucopolysaccharidosis have mental retardation. MR, ARMR. So we have an exception there and that's your, eh, that's your Marquio syndrome. I'm going to discuss about it later on and then... We go back here so your H so this H H should remind you of three things so let's put your H here so your H that should remind you of your something in your head that's your mental retardation something in your head again that's your coarse facial features coarse Coarse facial features. Features. Sorry for my handwriting. And then for the next H is that your, that's your hepatosplenomegaly. Hepatosplenomegaly. And then uh, that's actually about it. And then we have your gags affected. For your gags affected, we have your dermatan sulfate and heparan. Again, both of them are the same you have your dermatan sulfate and wait dermatan sulfate and your heparan sulfate sulfate okay so for the enzyme deficiency enzyme deficiency just remember that you have your H your H actually looks like an I 
So that means your eye, you have your eye here and you have your eye here. So this one, this is your Iduronides. 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 So your letter D there should remind you of your dermatan sulfate. Your I should remind you of your heparin sulfate as well as the name H. Hurler and Hunter. Now this one, I is also I do run I do run it. I do run it. I do run it. So your letter T E there should remind you of your hunter. That's your hunter. Hunter I do run it. I do run it sulfatase. Again for the gags. Uh the the gags will be that the gags that will be affected are these two. So we move on. So now we have your San Filippo syndrome. Right. So we have your San Filippo syndrome here. So I would like to say it San Filippo, San Filippo. San San San, San Filippo. <laughs> because there is actually hyperactivity here. So your so for your presentation you have your hyperactivity here. Again, for all of the mucopolysaccharidosis, we have your MR. MR. So, hyperactivity, MR. And then, I would like to say San Filippo. I will put San Filippo here. San Filippo. San Filippo. It seems a long name, right? And this Filippo has three syllables. That should remind you of MPS3. San Filippo. San Filippo. And because of his long word, there are actually different enzymes that is involved here. That's your heparin sulfate, heparin sulfate, and sulfatase, acetyl glucosaminidase, acetyl glucosaminidase, and glucosaminidase glucosaminidase and acetyltransferase and acetyltransferase and n acetyl glucosamine six sulfatase and i would like to remember this san filippo san 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 isan heparan san heparan isa lang isa lang san heparan lang isang heparan because the only gag affected here is heparan sulfate only so your san should remind you of your san heparan sulfate sulfate and then for number four your number four four this is your marquio marquio syndrome this is your number four so for this one mm, uh, the gags affected here is your keratin keratin and chondroitin chondroitin sulfate sulfate that's for your a and there's another b there's another one that's letter b that's keratin sulfate so, for your clinical presentation, this is the only mucopolysaccharidosis that doesn't have your MR. That's why I put Markioke. Markioke, like here. Markioke ako. I would put it like that. Markioke ako. Markioke CNS ko. Something like that. And then... Because the CNS is okay, your K there, again, should remind you of your keratin sulfate, keratin sulfate, keratin sulfate. So here, CNS is okay. That means, he is galak na galak. Galak na galak. Because the enzyme deficiency here is galactose 6-sulfatase. And the other one is B galactosidase. Galak na galak talaga. <laughs> so there, I'm going to put a divider here. Oh. Yes. And then, um, your O here 
should remind you about your odontoid hypoplasia. This is actually the one that has problems with your skeletal structure. So you have skeletal dysplasia here. And then you also have another O here to remind you. Ophtha, ophtha, ophtha clouding. Specifically, that's your corneal clouding. So I will put corneal clouding here. Corneal clouding, again, was the other one that we have. The skeletal, dis skeletal, skeletal dysplasia, as well as your odontoid, odontoid, odontoid hypoplasia. And with the skeletal dysplasia, you can also put your short stature there. Short stature, so you can say, Okay, okay, <laughs> okay, okay. You say it like that, and again, no CNS involvement. CNS involvement, so galak na galak siya. Involvement. And then, for the other one, you have your seven. Seven is your sly. That sounds like slime. Slime. So, your sly or slime should remind you or should ring about your glue. Glue. Glucuronidase. 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 So you have your three three letters. So you also have your DHC. So you have your dermatan sulfate. Heparan sulfate. And your chondroitin sulfate. Again, we have your MR here. And then you also have your corneal clouding. And then, you also have your hepatosplenomegaly. And your S, your S, your S should remind you again about the skeletal, dysplasia, and short stature. So, there you go. So, just to summarize, all of these are AR, except your X. Hunter x Hunter, and then your, all of these have MR except your Markio, Markio K. And then for the corneal clouding, the only ones that doesn't have corneal clouding is this. This one, no corneal clouding, no CC. And then Hunter, negative CC. Yes, so you have corneal clouding there. So, there you go. Hope this helps you guys.